Hey guys, so I just woke up and today's the day that I'm going to meet my Irish friend. Yeah, so the plan is I'm going to go to school in the morning and then I'm going to go straight to the concert after school. It's gonna be fun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not saying who, but someone. <laughs> oh my god. It's okay. Are you doing it And um, we got off to like. We got a couple of stops. Yeah. And then um, we obviously had to go back and go back into college <laughs> and get the ticket. And then go back to the train station and get on another train. It's fine, we're on the way. It's fine. What's the time now? Yes, on the first day on the second so, day. Like, the uh, doors should have opened an hour ago. So, we're quite a bit late. It's fine. Yeah, now. We're still gonna go. It's still gonna be awesome. It's still, still at least half. Uh -huh. at least half. I still have a chance of giving Josh Ramsey a blowjob. <laughs> the first day, because my first day was actually with you and Abby in Clackett Yeah. Even though you might say no. But I don't have a chance, but I'm gonna say I still do. So who's crazy? And you never know unless you ask. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna ask. I mean, it's legal. It's all legal. I mean, yeah. As long as it's legal, it's good. Yeah, it's legal. Yeah, it's cool.
I don't even know how you guys found us in the first place. It's, uh, it was her. We are truly grateful to be able to come this far around the world and find all of these amazing fans. You guys are so incredible. Thank you so much. First visit to the United Kingdom, every single show has been so bad. Touched us. 
Oh, that's uh, dude. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> but wow, <laughs> that just fucking happened. That just fucking happened. Oh my god. Oh holy shit. And oh my god. I like how like at, there were some moments where like the crowd was just singing and then like Josh was just kind of like what the fuck? <laughs> this is my fucking song. Why the fuck do you know the fucking lyrics? I can see the picture not behind I mean it was gonna happen. Oh holy shit! I need a pistol. <laughs> We were fucking late, but you know, yeah, who gives a shit? Fine, we, got that. we still got there and we still saw them! Alright, how do we okay, stalk them um, now? We're, tr we're gonna try question. and stalk them. Let's do um, stalking. Yeah, we're gonna stalk them. Alright, let's. Sh uh, if we find them, we'll let you know. So they didn't find them. No. No. Should I expect it? We are, we are heading back to McDonald's right now. We're hoping that they'll turn up because, you know. Yes, out of all the places, expect, right? yeah, you're you're a fucking Canadian <laughs> pop star, <laughs> pop rock, yes, <laughs> star. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, that's that's where you're gonna be. I also bought this shirt. I didn't actually say that in my last look. I bought this shirt. It was twenty pounds. Yay, twenty pounds well spent. <laughs> yeah, this. I also got a wristband. Cool. Free. It says empty on the back and it's great. Yeah. Holy shit. I'm never taking this off. That is that is to take mine off because drama. Oh nah. I cry every time. Okay. I'm kinda I'm having like first concert depression right now. Right? Uh, first oh. concert blues. I don't know if I said on camera, but like when I actually got in there, I like literally got a, had a panic attack real quick. And then I heard the, the music and I stopped having a panic attack and I completely forgot about it. And I was like, yeah, this, that's how it's supposed to be. Just fucking forget all about it. Oh, fuck. I'm never gonna be able to have a better night than this. This is, this is as good as it gets. This is as good as it fucking gets. Oh, that sounds depressing. <laughs> okay. Right, this this turned into the most depressing vlog I've ever done on my channel. Yep. Alright. Well, let's stop doing a depressing vlog. Oh, fuck, I got like, ah, shit all over it. Guys, so this is the day after, and I just remembered that I didn't actually say goodbye to you guys, so I'm just going to say goodbye real quick, and also just say that Oh, I'm still not fucking over it yesterday. Yesterday fucking blew my brains out. Old blew my dick off. <laughs> oh fuck. It's another reason why I love my reality shows because of that fucking trailer. That was the best fucking trailer ever. Like does any other band like do such an amazing tour trailer as blow your dick off? No, they don't. I guess to college today, so you know, I'm dedicated, and <laughs> it's so fucking sad as well, because like, oh, you know, she's such a big fucking thing, what company made this? <gasps> it's the fucking company that I like, what the fuck? I knew it! I knew it was that company from the way the material felt, the fuck? I'm sorry, I, I thoroughly enjoy this company, okay? I'm done. <laughs> I swear this is not sponsored, if they were gonna sponsor someone, they would sponsor some more famous YouTuber, trust me. Yeah, I did just watch videos back. I especially watched uh, back the video where um, they performed Good To You, uh, which is going to be on my second channel, because I don't want to upload it to my main channel because it's just the full song and that is actually illegal and I don't want to do illegal stuff on my other channel to make sure that, you know, you know? Keeping my channel safe. And I don't like stealing from from bands, especially Mariana Strange, but you know. People deserve it, you know. You deserve it. You deserve to watch Good to You being performed in London. I, I watched it back and at the end of the song I just started crying actually, because I was like, that's that was that was amazing. I I started crying and I fucking oh fuck. I was fucking crying. I don't usually cry, but I was crying this time. And oh fuck. I can't fucking believe it. Oh, that was. I'm still not over that. I'm still not fucking over that. I don't think I'm ever gonna be over that. I think in five years I'm still gonna look back at this and be like, fuck, I'm scared. I'm 
five years from now they're gonna be in England again. So the next time they're coming, I'm gonna see them again because I can't not. You know, if they're coming soon, I'm gonna be so fucking happy. I mean, if this fucking tour was so good, then they should be coming back. Hopefully, I don't know. Who knows? I hope they'll come back. Everyone hopes they'll come back. There was also a few, like, after we've left, left the venue, we still, like, saw some other fans just walking around London and, like, we were looking at each other like, mm hmm There was this girl who was wearing a Fix Me shirt, it just said the word Fix Me, and I was like, oh my god, girl, girl, girl. And honestly, like, like you don't really even need to, like... I feel like sometimes you don't even need to look at their shirt and it's just very obvious that they you were at the same concert had a very similar vibe but then there were like there were like a few people who looked very similar and then there were a few people who looked very different they were like there was some punk guy as well with like a fucking mo like I know I have a mohawk I technically technically it's a lazy hawk but you know there was this fucking guy with like a fucking awesome mohawk and I was like dude I mean to be fair my Kaylee has a mohawk so Whatever. I didn't really play anything from their first album, or at least by the time we were there, they weren't really playing anything. I was hoping to uh, hear Shake Trap, but they never played Shake Trap. Uh, that's that's like the one thing that I was like, yeah, I want to hear fucking Shake Trap. They never played it, so I was very sad. I was very very sad indeed. Um, but you know, if you don't want to play Shake Trap, that's fine. I guess they're kind of like stepping away from the emo. Thing. They're trying to be a bit more pop, and I understand that, you know. I understand. Yeah, okay, that's all I wanted to say. Bye. Bye, guys. Have fun, and don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>